Today, I want to let you all in on one of my favorite little optimizations in Super Auto Pets. If you have an early level 2 fish, you can start leveling a whole other fish, and once they're both level 2, you can bind them together. Now, you're not going to get any more level up pet rewards, but you can squeak in an extra plus 2, plus 2 in stats, which can make a big difference early game. If you don't employ it yet, you're missing out. Trust me. Okay, let's go here. Pull something like this. Sure. Like me a good double level up turn three. Oh, is this gonna be enough? No, definitely not. <laughs> not even close. The ants are really strong early. Okay, we got back to five. That's that's the takeaway here. That's the important part. I mean I'll go double tropical, why not? That'll do. Okay. We probably want to have the seahorse in the middle, now that I think about it. Well, we can... we can pivot. Okay. Yeah, let's go seahorse in the middle. And I'll give you an apple. Don't say I won't, because I will. Give you a meat bone. Okay, I think that's fine. I think Pillbug needs to go soon, for sure. So he has putting in his his weight. He's earning his place. Okay, tier three. What have we got? Level up me. Hawk is pretty good. I think I'll gladly take a hawk here. Uh, let's roll one. Maybe we just go a whole bunch of tropical fish. I don't know. Maybe that's the play. I think this makes more sense here. We'll have the cockroach as our, our closer, if you will. Beautiful stuff. He swapped us around, but it actually kind of worked out in our favor. Okay, go here. Go here. Let's just try to get you leveled up here. Maybe we're early enough still to take a goldfish. I don't think we need the cockroach hanging out there. We're getting enough scaling here. We're picking up the slack in the front end. Huge. Big stuff. We're already at five wins and five hearts. That's awesome. Um, yeah, we can get rid of you. Grab a penguin. Huge. And you gotta go husky, right? <laughs> Somebody was telling me that I'm sleeping on the goldfish in one of my earlier videos. I was like, alright. I'm going to try out the goldfish just for you, and then <laughs> sell him one turn later. <laughs> I will continue sleeping on the goldfish, apparently. I do agree, though. The goldfish has its place. You got to get it early, though. I think that's the key. You get it on a level up, turn three. That's great. Anything more, though? You know, you're kind of pushing it. Could grab a hippo. Honestly, dude, I don't... Against tier 4 pets or higher. I don't know if I'm into that hippo game right now. Thinking maybe we... We say thanks but no thanks. And wait for a higher value Omi to come around. The hippo's back again. <laughs> oh, I don't know. Maybe it's good enough. Get rid of the penguin, he's scaling up the wrong guy anyways. Run a little something like this. Sure. Okay. He's getting plus one, plus four every round. That's pretty good. Is it like amazing? No, but 
Does it need to be? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Evidently not. We're doing all right. Huge level up here. I mean, you gotta go boar, right? You gotta go boar. We can keep the hawk around, I think. Yeah, I think this makes sense. We'll do that. Swap you guys around. You're more of a cleanup kind of guy since you're more attack focused. Gotta get another husky though. That's for sure. Close. That was actually very close. Um, I think we could get rid of the tropical fish. Instead of three health, give him one one. That's probably better, right? Don't want to be too ale heavy, if you will. All right. I think that should be good. I'd love to take Rhino, but we do not have the space for him. Alright, we're just going to stack Huskies. I think we got a great team right now. So I do think... <laughs> that was interesting. Um, I do think we need to move the Hawk. Set him in the back here. Now the Pineapple doesn't do very well with the Hawk. Like it would the Crocodile. So that and it's not going to get buffed by the Huskies. If it's got pineapple, we probably don't need it. Oh, he's got the squad. <laughs> oh, no, no. I get some levels up in here. Where are all my boars at? Don't think we need the hawk, we need the boars. And they're getting 4-4 four, four around, it's just... These guys are also really strong. <laughs> the hard thing is they've got... The, the guys stacking monkeys are gonna sweep our guys, you know? And we go here, we can double freeze. I think we're focusing the boar with the chocolate here. Oh, he's got a baby boar over here. What the heck? Cool. That'll do. Oh, we got to 10. <laughs> that, ladies and gentlemen, is why early wins are fantastic. I didn't even realize we were at nine wins already. Yeah, hyperscaling. Okay, wide scaling is pretty good. I still think single target scaling is probably better, but you can get cheesed pretty easily too. That's that's my take on it. A moon hat. Uh, are we doing this? No. Surely not. Yes, we're doing it. No. Okay. Let's just do an apple. I think 3-4 is better. The... I don't like any of these. <laughs> Maybe some fallen chestnuts. Too much weirdness going on with those names. Okay. That was expected. Um, Double bulldog, I guess. Not what I would hope for, but here we are. Not bad, we'll take those. Back up to five. No sweat in it. Could do a dodo bird. Some <laughs> weird wording, but you get the idea. <laughs> I don't think scaling, like leveling up Bulldog is really at all necessary. So we're not going to. We're just going to leave him level 2. I think that's plenty. Huge. That'll work. 
Salamander's pretty good, especially if we're setting up for this dodo. I say we go for it. Could go crab as well. Do we have enough health scalers? Maybe. We could make ourselves have enough. Huge, huge. I think this is the play. We hyperscale the salamander's health. Naturally, he's going to get a lot of attack. And he's going to be our big dog in the house. Oh, okay. This is perfect. Let's run it like this. We can keep the dodo, I think. Go here. Looks like we're keeping the dodo. I think we go here, sell the fish, and go here. Or are we keeping the dodo? Maybe we don't. Maybe we do something like this instead. Could be interesting. Then we'll have our crab holding up the back. Caboosing it, if you will. So close. So close, yet so far. Okay. Crab, great. Give the salamander a little something to go off of. I'll freeze a little bacon. Don't want anyone thinking I'm a bacon hater. Bacon hater, bacon hater. What? Yeah, I don't know about this this whole crab thing. It's not really panning out too well. I think the issue we got here, that's good. Issue is we need to we need to be scaling the salamander, not the dodo bird. What am I thinking? I'm rolling. I'm rolling. We gotta get some here. If we don't start getting some level, this is not gonna end well. Okay, that's good. Our crab is pitiful right now. <laughs> Good. Rhino seems to make some some amount of sense. We could go Rhino. We really gotta get Husky out here. That's what we need. Maybe run something like this now. You know, what if that's what if that's what we need to do? I think Salamander has, he's had his shot, threw a hard air ball, <laughs> didn't bring any of his friends, and that's just, that's not going to cut it. Gotta do better. Okay, tier 5 unlocked. We just got a hard roll for Husky at this point. I don't think there's any... Ifs and or buts. Oh, dude, come on. <laughs> Don't make me do this. We can't even get both of them right now. I think Crab has got to go. Salamander's next on the chopping block. Yeah, okay, bring all your friends now that I said that. Crab gone. Crocodile, you're in. And monkey. See if we can pull it back together. We got a lot of health, at least. That's something, right? Okay. Oh boy. This is... I mean, this is the pivot. If we can make it work, this is the round to do it. Okay, I mean, we'll switch to Raph as soon as we find a husky. But I think for now, this is a good start.
Holy Jesus, that is a huge otter. <laughs> oh, good lord. Um... Roll one. Nothing. We gotta get this rhino going. I mean, he's gotta get to level at least two. Otherwise, we're in trouble. Oh, we're in so much trouble. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, that's good. Uh, okay. I'd like to go tiger. I don't know if we can afford it. I think we do this. Card stack here. Hope it's good enough. Oh no, not like this. It was not good enough. We got cheesed. Just like we had said. I foretold it. I knew there was going to be scorpion in the front. Cheese are one big rhino. Okay. Bulldog, Billbug, Cockroach. The three greats. Could be some... <laughs> Discombobulated drivers. We actually tied. Okay. We take those. Okay, so now we're getting the power squad in here. As if it's not already too late. I think we run something kind of like that. Yeah, that's close enough. Okay. That's big. Huge win. You beat the T-Rex costume guy. Giraffe or tropical fish? That is the question. Um, we could probably get rid of the cockroach. This, I think wider scaling could do us solid here. Let's sell you. Get another one of you. Alright. See if this is enough to do anything meaningful. If drawing is meaningful, then it is. It's actually just enough. Huge. Got our little double fish action. My favorite combo. That hurts. That definitely does not feel good. But we got our double fish now. And that's what matters. And the bison. Oh, Baby, this is going to be it. Mark my words. It's going to be a banger right here. You two are sticking around for a bit, so we'll start scaling you up. Okay, sure. I think we can lead with the bulldog. He's got enough. He's got a 510 right now. He's, he can handle himself. There you go. He did just fine. Way to go, Bulldog. Okay, here. Um, get rid of you. Set a goldfish here in the back. Just enough to hopefully do something here. And honestly, I think we're just kind of looking for some... Some level ups, waiting until turn four and five. That's the primary objective right now. 
we've got enough scaling as is that we're not too worried. That's pretty big. Huge. Less huge. We could maybe go scorpion instead of bulldog. This is right around where they're going to start getting some cheeky huge units in the front. Honestly, dude, that's fine. Sure. Level me. Speaking of cheeky units in the front, how much are you? Five? Are we going for a giant scorpion, maybe? Or is tropical fish not even worth it? No, I think he is. You can throw him on you. Alright. Dude, I'm just too impatient for the goldfish. I think that's my problem. As soon as you get anything remotely viable <laughs> it's like the goldfish is a 1-5 <laughs> or he's a 3-7 or whatever he was certainly that's not worth keeping around and then you toss him all right tier five this is the big big tier turns okay two two or zero four split up or two three on one. I think that's a pretty clear decision. I do have to keep an eye on how we're gonna buff this bison once we get rid of the fish. I have no level twos. Penguin's not gonna make a whole lot of sense here. And I'd love a husky. You know, that'd be kinda cool. Sure. Maybe swap into a rhino. Say heck the bison scaling. Not even that good anyways. It's a 1-2 per turn. I'm seeing double. Okay. I think that's exactly what we need to do. We need to go here. Give you one roll. Not quite the role I was hoping for. Okay. Throw some lasagna in the oven on turn 10. See how that does. Oh, dude, these scorpions are killing me right now. Literally. Sell you, throw a monkey in there. <laughs> this feels pretty bad <laughs> but sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do you know that'll do that was very satisfying go here go here you're gonna have to go Gotta get the Rhino early, and then get him to 50 attack, probably. Then we can swap over. Swap over to the, the boar. Freeze you for a second here. Are you getting 12, 8, 12 in stats every turn? Not half bad. Okay, I think it's time we put the boar up here. We could grab a husky. That honestly, I don't, I don't know if husky's worth it. We'll hang on to him for a second. Maybe he is. We'll think on it for a turn. Huge. Okay, I've decided it's not. Tiger is the only other thing that we're looking for. 
just a tiger. Could go here, I think. That would make some amount of sense. We're getting a lot of monkeys out here. That's for sure. Okay. Jokes on you. All my units are good. Except for the monkeys. <laughs> um I mean high key. Let's get the monkeys going a bit more, you know? I will throw in as many monkeys as you give me, and I mean that. <laughs> Okay. Agree to disagree. I'll put it that way. <laughs> All right. Throw the scorpion back in the front. Um, keep that frozen. I don't know what we want to use it on quite yet. Or is good. Kind of want to just hang on to the chocolate until one of these lines up. Sure. That'll do. We're at nine again. We haven't gotten cheesed too hard by scorpions since we had that little, little problem issue, whatever you want to call it. All right, the boar has led his case and we, we give him it. <laughs> that was kind of close. <laughs> okay. We might need another scorpion. More monkeys. Always need more monkeys. And you go back here now. Get you more attack. Dude, we're getting... They got too much scaling. <laughs> we're not keeping up. We got all these guys. Alright, monkey in the front now. This is the play. We don't even need chocolate. We just... There's so many monkeys. Give me like steak or something. Can I have a steak for this monkey in the front? Pretty please? Thank you. Let's see if this is enough. I don't know. Maybe there's too many 50-50s. That's the name of the game. That's this weekly in a nutshell. If you manage to get to turn 19, the entire enemy team is going to be 50-50s. <laughs> oh, man. Not even with this big scorpion cheese are we able to survive. Well, that was a fun one. A good way to end the weekly. Hope you all enjoyed. I certainly did. If you did, drop a like, comment, sub. I love hearing from y'all. Let's me know what kind of videos you enjoy. But for now, I will see you all on the next episode. Have a good one.